Anthony Fauci, to encourage vaccination amid rising cases of the Delta variant. According to a June report from the U.S. Centers for Disease Control and Prevention CDC, roughly 38% of Americans aged 18 to 29 years old have received at least one dose, which is the lowest among any other age group. I am beyond honored and humbled to be here today to help spread the message about the importance of youth vaccination, Rodrigo said to a press audience. I'm in awe of the work President Biden and Dr. Fauci have done and was happy to help lend my support to this important initiative. It's important to have conversations with friends and family members encouraging all communities to get vaccinated, and actually get to a vaccination site, which you can do more easily than ever before, given how many sites we have and how easy it is to find them at vaccines.gov. A White House official told CNN that Rodrigo will record videos about the importance of young people getting vaccinated, including answering important questions young people have about getting vaccinated. After her briefing room appearance, a short video was posted on the official White House Twitter page showing Rodrigo encouraging all people, even if they are young and healthy, to get vaccinated. More videos will appear on her social media. Rodrigo appeared at the White House after communicating with the president on Instagram. Biden posted a photo of himself as a younger man, captioning, I know this young person would have gotten vaccinated, but we've got to get other young people protected as well. Who's willing to help? The pop star responded, I'm in. See you tomorrow at the White House, to which Biden confirmed, you bet. While Olivia is busy using her platform for good use, fans are openly admiring Rodrigo's outfit, with one fan comparing it to Jackie Kennedy's iconic pink Chanel suit. Rodrigo has become a rising star this year, thanks to her debut album, Sour, released in May, and her massive singles, Deja Vu, which peaked at No. 3 on the Billboard Hot 100, and, Good For You, and, Driver's License, which both hit No. 1. Driver's License topped the Hot 100 for eight straight weeks. Pop Music Olivia Rodrigo